fam, it's Lady Nadra. I know I'm looking busted and disgusted. Don't judge me. Guys, don't judge me. <laughs> welcome to my channel and welcome back to those of you. And for those of you who rock with me, you know, you know, I normally zhuzh it up for my intros, but um, this is a vlog. And so, you know, you see me this way anyway. And um, I just wanted to get on here real quick and do this so that I can hurry up and bust this video. I'll get the video out for you guys, you know, today. All right. So welcome. Welcome back. If it's, you know, if you're a returning subscriber and if it's your first time, don't hold this against me. All right, y'all. Don't hold it against me. <laughs> Be nice. Watch my video anyway. All right. <laughs> Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this one. This is a vlog, just a regular vlog, you know. My life. Hope you enjoy it. Y'all make sure y'all come in and see Dina when you come to Nordstrom South Coast. Yes, yes, and uh -huh. I'll be here. <laughs> so I found my mom some boots. I found her some boots. They are um, Dior Bonnet Blanc. Okay. And they are a full on boot though. You know, right up under the knee. And they are kitten heel. You can't see I'm behind it. They got a kitten heel, and it's kind of a flared heel. I mean, a nice, nice square on it. So that should balance her out pretty good. And it has a zipper. This is by Ann Klein. I got them from Macy's, and um, she got a size ten and a half. So she wears a ten. But I figured this ten and a half would be good. It has um, elastic right here, but I don't think she's gonna need any more, any extra stretch. Um, I think this is gonna be just fine. But I got her some boots, and um, hold on, I got her a dress by Farm Rio. I've been having my eye on this dress and it ended up on sale. <laughs> when that happens, I just know that's the Lord leading me because I started to buy the dress several times, but I don't know, something was just making me wait. But this is the dress. Let me see if I can. a nice sweater dress the sleeves are kind of like puffed this i don't know the pattern and everything just i think she's gonna like it so um probably wear this sunday and that's all i got oh i got a wig in so you guys, I bought, a, I bought this wig a few weeks ago and I colored it and I was going to wear it and all that. And I had Morgan cut it for me and to my instruct, and it was my instruction for her to cut it shorter, but I didn't realize and she didn't realize that when we cut it in the back, um, like if I held my head down, the, it was too short back here. So I, I was trying to get a, a blunt bob, but it was just too short, so it wasn't expensive. It was a cheap little wig by Smavita Hair. Smavita Hair. 
and I got this on Amazon. Um, this is how it comes, so I'm gonna have to color this one again because I don't know, it's just too yellow. It's blonde and it's too yellow. <laughs> and I'm I'm gonna make myself wear this wig, y'all. Cause but it's so yellow. Look at look how yellow it is. I'm gonna tone it and I'm gonna cut it again, but I'm probably just I'm not just not so short. I'm gonna make myself wear it, even if I wear it with a um a little beret. Definitely not this long. Mm -mm. The other one didn't look super bad. It didn't look bad, honestly. It was just too short in the back. But I don't like it like this. Happy New Year, babe. <laughs> Happy New Year. Was that right? <laughs> Is that right? Good morning, y'all. It's Saturday. <coughs> Sorry, it's Saturday morning. Well, it's Saturday at noon. It's actually 12.15. Um, normally my Saturday routine is I get up and I go tend to my mom and all that. My brother was trying to come out here, um, today and ride the train, but the train schedule is all jacked up. So he wouldn't be able to get here to this evening. So I was trying to wait for him to go see my mom. That was what my plan was, but it looks like he might not even be coming. So, um, now I am, I'm running over to Aritzia real quick cause I, I had ordered in store, I ordered a sweater and it's in. I forgot that they told me that it was in. And so I should have gotten it earlier this week, but I didn't. So, um, however, I was planning on wearing, when in my, I knew my Hanifa dress was coming in and um, I was gonna wear that to church, but um, yeah, I'm gonna send that back. <laughs> I'm gonna send that Hanifa back dress back. It's like nylon, um, and it's tight, it's form fitting. It doesn't look bad, I just don't, I don't want it. So, I thought it was knit, and that would have been so bomb if it were knit, but it's not. So I'm gonna send it back Monday, and um, so I'm gonna go pick up this sweater that I ordered um, weeks ago. <laughs> I ordered it in store, and I'm gonna go pick it up. And maybe I can, you know, juice that up and work it out out for tomorrow um, for church. After that, then I'll go by and, and see about Mama. Either I'm going to go by there first or I'm, I'm, I'm that's what I want to do. I want to get back in enough time to go and see about Mama and then go to the car wash and then come park my car in the um, garage right from the car wash. That would be my preference. Um, so my car can be all nice and clean when I drive to church. I, why is that a thing? Like, I don't, we do so much. We do so much, you know, to put our best foot forward for Sunday, you know. And I know um, that's where that that uh, the show title Sunday Best comes in, because you know, us black folks, we've been doing that for years. You gotta get your car washed, roll to church. You gotta get your outfit ready to go to church. You gotta get your hair done for church. <laughs> it's like a big um, preparation thing. And these days, that stuff doesn't even, you know, people show up. You know, in shorts and things like that. But anyway, um, it's still a thing for me. Uh, oh, hold on, my brother's calling. Now I'm going to pick him up from Cerritos College. He's gonna Uber to Cerritos College, and then I'll meet him there. It's still a thing for me. I still want to put my best foot forward for for church. I don't know. It, it 
that's something that I'll ever do. I don't know if it's because my age, you know, old older people normally get tend to get set in their ways. But I just couldn't imagine going to church. I have because we have casual Sundays and stuff like that. I've worn tennis shoes and things like that. But I still prepare. My, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's not like I'm just getting up throwing on anything like I would to go to the grocery store. I couldn't imagine. I'm not saying that you shouldn't or that anybody else should. I just that would be that would be something difficult for me to approach in that way. Now look at my brother looking like Sam Jackson. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Happy New Year. <laughs> What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> The new year. Hopefully, <laughs> this one is better. Yeah, you know. <laughs> right. This the sleeves are a little short. A little short. Yeah. They said it's really nice. This is badass, but like not it. for LA. I mean, <laughs> yeah. last week was the only time it. I would have been able to wear it. You know. <laughs> it's so cool. That one, though, the one you got is nice. Huh? That's a nice. Try that, that one on one more time. That's a nice color for you and everything. Oh yeah. Yeah. Your Sam Jackson look. <laughs> That's your Sam Jackson look. Say <laughs> one again. <laughs> that jacket is fresh. Turn around. Back. Oh, no. let me see the back. That is so dope. Size, you don't have a size up. Huh? Well, let me check. Actually, what, what's the price on it? Let me check it. Huh? No, I can do it way better than that. You can walk in these? Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. I don't know if these, you can walk in these. These might be a little too much for Glory Jane. <laughs> you think so? No. <laughs> you, you say no. It ain't too much. <laughs> oh, I gotta see that. Check this out. This is gonna look so hot on you, Mama. It's gonna stick out on me. Let me see. Be done. And some boots. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's what they told me. Ooh, that's gonna be cute. That's gonna be super cute. You like it? It already do, fits your I hips too. Like huh? You do like it? Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That's gonna be really nice. Mm -hmm. Wow. Turn around, take some let me look at you. Huh? Turn the light on. She said, "Turn around, <laughs> let her look." Woo! <laughs> <laughs> fancy. Fancy. <She's> fancy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, here we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> we have to, we'll take the tag off for you. Pull it down.
She what gets the that? house pan rust. I get the um the fisherman's, the fisherman's chowder. That is amazing. This is Megan's first time, guys. Mm -hmm. I'm at the boiler. <laughs> <laughs> this is um what is this kettle? What is it? Kettle what? It's um steam kettle cooking. Steam kettle cooking. Yes. It's just amazing. Yes. My lashes look good. I'm gonna do. I have on a strip and my lashes. Oh, your um, because you do have a Yeah, because I got an appointment this week. Oh. So they're kind of skimpy. I didn't want to um. Mm-hmm. Hi. He's coming. Hi. So I put ten dollars on my little card here, but I don't know how much money it takes to to dry each time. I'm looking for the sign. There's no signage to tell me how much. Um, so I gotta get another mask to tell me how much time or how much money it costs to dry each time. Um, but I'm gonna keep sliding this card until it won't slide anymore. I think ten dollars should do it. I just started it over again. Or maybe there's somebody here I can ask. I'm gonna find out. So the lady just told me that these 90 pound washers, she said they're really they get everything really clean. She put two comforters and um, her blanket in there to wash the 90 pound uh, washer. And she said everything got super, super clean, but it's $10, <laughs> 9 dollars to to wash a load in those 90 pound washers. And then the dryer that I use, the 50 pound dryer, um, she said that it's 60 cents for nine minutes. So um, I'm probably gonna end up giving this card <laughs> to somebody else, uh, cause I don't think I'm gonna have to dry it that many times you know what I mean I put it in the big dryer so that it would dry faster but I, you only get nine minutes on there but I checked it and it was you know it was pretty dry so if I keep just rotating it I think it'll be fine I don't know why the man came and asked me he asked me to help him he had some cash and he was trying to uh, this is a coinless laundry so he was trying to change his his $20 bill and get a card for, um, to use the washing machine. And he was asking me, I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> so I was trying to help him figure it out. We got it worked out finally. I'm so dumb in here. <laughs>
morning it's wednesday and um i'm here picking up april we're getting ready to run to south coast real quick um i think it's just a jacket i want to pick up so here she comes say good morning good morning good morning, good morning. <laughs> Tell the people good morning. There you go. <laughs> April has body dysmorphia. She's still going to the plus size section in the stores and she's not plus size. <laughs> You're not plus size. So we're gonna go find the regular straight sizes and um, find what you're looking for, okay? Okay. Good morning, it's January, I almost said December. It's January 6th, uh, 2022. <laughs> I'm still not used to saying it. I don't know why, but anyway. Um, so I'm on my way to Target. I gotta pick up some stuff from Target. And then I gotta go by my mom's. Um, I got an email from them saying that I think I may have to be COVID tested now, or if you're gonna go in there, you have to have a negative COVID test in order to go in. Um, of course, they want you to be boosted, you know, all the all the things, um, but as well, they're throwing on there a negative COVID test, which, I mean, that's gonna be a hassle because we try to have somebody go in there. My brother goes Monday, Kathy goes Tuesday. Um, I go Wednesday and Thursday. And Rachel goes Friday. I go Saturday again. And then we sit at church on Sunday. So I don't even know if that I'm gonna be able to bring her out for church. I don't know how that's gonna work, to be honest. So um, I'll find out when I go up here, what's what with that. And then I'm supposed to be going today to meet um, a subscriber for lunch. And so we're gonna meet up at Victoria's Gar Victoria Gardens at Yard House, uh, which I don't really know what I'm... The last few times I've been to Yard House, my husband likes something at Yard House, um, but I never like anything there. I never have any luck there or um, Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> Yeah, those two places I just, I never have any luck finding something that I really like, so. But I'ma go, you know. Everything we do is centered around eating, so I can find something, I can find a salad. If nothing else, I'll find a salad that I like, eat a salad. And, um, but I'm looking forward to meeting her. Um, she seems like a nice lady. Um, yeah. We like fashion, so we'll talk about that kind of stuff. That's for sure. The building that our church has been occupying since, mm, I want to say 19, I'm, I'm sorry, since like 2001, 2000 or 2001, something like that. Um, this is our last Sunday there this Sunday, so. Uh, we are going to be moving to Citrus Hills Intermediate uh, School. And so we're not gonna have rehearsal tonight because a few of my praise team um, members have COVID. So I just wanna kinda 
and then a couple of them are, one of them is getting over COVID. Another one had a procedure done today. Um, and then two of them have COVID. So it's like, mm, let's just, we're gonna have a Zoom call. <laughs> you know what I mean? We're just gonna have a Zoom call and kind of get on the same page for our move because we've been, you know, we've been doing what we've been doing for 20 years in the same space. I don't think it's going to be a difficult transition for, for the praise team um, or the church for that matter, but I do want us to um, kind of get a game plan because we're going to have to have different re rehearsal space and all that kind of stuff. So the musicians and the praise team will have a Zoom call and, you know, just kind of check in with one another, pray, love on one another, that kind of thing. You know, we're a family. We've been singing together a long time, y'all. For he has made me glad. Yeah. He has made me glad. He has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad. He has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Yeah. That's a great one. Thank you. Uh-huh. How about amazing grace? How sweet the sound that time I will bless the Lord. Say, I will bless the Lord, oh my soul, and all, and all that is within me, bless his home. Say he has done great things for me. Yes. Ready? Yes. Say he has done great things for Hallelujah. Yeah. He has done great things. He has done great things. Bless his home. Name. Yes. Thank you, sister. Thank you. Thank you, sister. Mm-hmm. Yes. I forgot where um yard well actually I didn't forget where Yard House was. I don't think I ever paid attention to Yard House because I never really eat there, but she saw me driving around, so she uh, came and filmed me. Um, so now we're just looking for a place to park. Yay, I'm excited. Look, y'all. <laughs> Look where I found. I don't care. Or this one. Or I don't walk care. Down. You don't care? I don't care, either one. Oh, okay. Yeah, because we've been communicating uh, on Instagram. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me get my. <laughs> I told you. I said, don't forget. <laughs> don't your forget camera. your camera. You look hey, so pretty. You do too. Uh huh. Fashionista for real. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> We're gonna go around to anthropology and um, hopefully they have the candle that I like. Okay, so just so you know, this candle, <laughs> this one, and this black one that Fantasy is fair is holding, they're all the same scent. <laughs> They're all the same thing. Okay. Hey y'all, I'm doing a video, honey. <laughs> That's right. You wanna get in? Hey man, same let's stop playing dramatic on Instagram. Let's go. Music videos are coming out. Dramatic? Yep. Dramatic. You, you said that kind of fast. Dramatic. It's oh, that's you? Uh, spell it. At Dramatic, D R E W M A T L C. Music all right. Videos. Last one we did was Draco and Almighty Suspect. We're coming next. Oh, okay. okay. You do what? He, he said, but this is, my, this is my real job right here, so I don't want to. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> now this is mine, look at it. She said, they done reformulated the beat. reformulated beat on me. So this is ours, the one I'm putting on you right now, okay? <laughs> this is yours. Reformulated it, Major. Let me see. They reformulated it, girl. See, it is a little darker. You see that? Uh huh. Yeah, what y'all doing? Your, I don't know. Your eye is keen, girl. Oh, <laughs> she said, I don't know. That did look a little light. I'm like, hold on, wait a minute. I'm hung up in here. This one's a little. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's a little lighter. Okay. Yours is darker. Yeah, that is crazy. Other, it's too chalky for me. Do you wait. have anything close to the beat that I have? <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't try to put a little fast one on there. They didn't switch that, switch that beat liner up. <laughs> that ain't happening. <laughs> Find something else from a different brand. Baby, um, Charlotte Tilbury. Maybe. I haven't tried them, but or like makeup forever. Maybe. Okay. I hear the they're Um. So tell me which which guy. Oh, oh we see the guy with the, the black pants. The, the black pants. The black pants. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Long hair. You want my phone? No! What the hell is your I'm a G. Don't worry about me. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> well, I ain't gonna be running after him now. Hold on. Good morning. Putting on my eye cream. Um, My Ole Henriksen. That's what I use for under my eye. And I'm putting a little bit above my eye. I'm on my way to get my lashes filled. And so I... uh. If y'all got lashes and you know they, they put all that tape and stuff all around your eyes. So I like to uh make sure that I moisturize. Cause girl. Woo. They tape everything down. They gotta tape all your your bottom lashes down. And then they, they gotta pull your eye up. Oh, it'd be so much tape on your eyes. So Anyway, I'm going to go get my lashes done. And then I was thinking about, I'm trying to figure out where can I buy a um, a planner. I need a planner. I'm thinking about either buying one, a physical one to have, or maybe I should look at some apps and see. That probably is more practical for me. But I just want to, I want to, you know, explore the world of planners because I really plan to step up my game. And I'm, I'm, by telling you guys that I'm, you know, committing myself, which is what I'm trying to do more of, you know, sticking to my guns this year. Um, but yeah, I need to organize my life, organize my thoughts. I mean, I have pretty much a regimen, but I need to write it down. I need to learn how to, the Bible even says, write the vision and make it plain. You know what I mean? So I want to do that. Um... And I think a planner will help me. Y'all know of anything else? Or an app 
I feel like an app will make it easier for me because I'll always have my phone with me should I need to, um, you know, jot something down real quick. And I'm not that person that's going to carry a big enough bag all the time to, um, to um, write it down. So to have, you know, to have the planner inside of a bag and da, 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 da. I'm not organized enough for that. So. But I do want something that will help me simplify my strategies, you know? All right, lash is done. My eyes are red. Um, the glue sometimes, you know, irritates me once I open my eyes. The, the glue kind of burns sometimes, so that's why they're red. But, um, woo! I like when my lashes are done. Actually, they're heavy right now, so I'll like them next week. But honestly, um, getting them done, oh, it just takes so long. It's like, I don't have that many eyelashes, do I? Because <laughs> it's like she just keeps finding another one to add something to. And I like that they're full now. I don't like the way they look when they're super full. I like them better once a few of them fall out and next week and the week after is when I really like them. Um, so by the third week, I'm normally wearing, if it's a Sunday that falls in there, I'll put a strip on when they start looking too sparse. I'll put one of my little thin um, strips on with them. But today I always say on this day, Right after I get them done, I always say I'm not going to get them done again, but <laughs> I don't know. I might. Mm. Our Starbucks, was there any hot food or pastry items I could get started for you today? Um, no, no hot food or pastry items. Can I get a peach tranquility tea? Ooh, yes. Excellent, excellent choice. What size are you thinking? Um, I want venti and I want um, half lemonade, half water. Alrighty, did we maybe want to even add some peach juice to that to make it even more peach? Mmm, that sounds good. So, I had on lip gloss. <laughs> Why did I put on lip gloss? And I know I gotta wear these doggone masks. Alright, so I got something in from Cameo DeBoer. DeBoer. D D E B O R E. With the accent mark. Got my trusty dusty knife. I'm going to get a box cutter one day, I promise. Okay. It's too light to be what I want it to be. So. Um, This is this um, clutch bag, this custom clutch bag that I had made. It feels really nice, guys. Um, oh, look at this. Okay, this is not, this is not the, uh, look at this part. What? Carry that like that. Ooh! Who do I think I am? This is so fresh now. This is more of a, a statement piece than it is to be really carrying anything. It is like, you know, it's, it's East West for sure, but you're not gonna get a whole lot in there. I mean, enough, but this is so fresh. People are going to be like, what is that? This is my bag. This is from Cameo. Let me see what's, what's in here that I can give you guys some deets. Lots of paper. Now, they did have to custom make this. So, um, and I found them on Instagram. Luxury cut Clutch Collection. Let's 
Oh, here's the thank you card. So let me see if I can get some information on here. I like it. They have all kinds of different styles. But you know how you are when you're not familiar with something? Oh, they got, they even have a um a belt that's kind of like the Obi belt, the Loy Ve Obi, Obi belt. Hmm. Because who wants to pay $900? thousand Ooh, we come to our welcome to our lady our lady like movement and please tag us in a pick when you rock your clutch i can't see that cameo all right so this is a thank you card um and what's their Instagram? I'll put it on the screen. What the Instagram is, Cameo DeBoer Clutches. Um, I'll put it on the screen with the, I'm gonna put this in the bag so I'll remember what I did with it. This card, this is dope, y'all. This is dope. I mean, it was custom made. It looks pretty well made. I don't know how they got these on here, but we'll see. All right, then I got a couple of things from Amazon in. Um, is this Amazon? Mm, just open it, Nature. I'll be trying not to break my nails open in this stuff. Oh! I ordered some more. I ordered serving spoons. I thought they were going to be bigger than this. I ordered serving spoons, but here we go. We got regular. These are regular forks. Anyway, I ordered two of these, so here we have it. They do match my silverware, though. Look how little that is. I guess it'll serve what it's supposed to serve, huh? All right. And then I got... This, I think this is a bra. I think. Yes, I got two of these bras from... Diva New Look. Um, those, they're the deep V bras and it's supposed to come up really high up under your arm to get that little fat piece under control. <laughs> I need that. So. <laughs> okay, y'all. So I tried on the bra. I got it on now. It does take care of that, that back fat. This right here, it definitely does that. But then what it does is it pushes everything in and by it being a deep V, Everything is sitting right here, loose. Now, I would say this is useless, but it's not useless. I just feel like my boobs will come out, <laughs> but I can put on, what I've been doing is put on two bras. I could put on two, one to, you know, grab this middle part and then this one to, and see what that does. I don't know. The woes of big boobs. Why do y'all want boobs? I, I don't get it. Why do y'all want them? They're hot. They're so inconvenient. You can't wear what you want to wear. I don't, I don't get it. I'm walking around in this bra, guys. And what I'll say is because of the back, how it gets your back fat under control, and you don't have a little back titty hanging over. <laughs> um, I like it for that, but I don't like it that it pushes everything here. But listen, if you are one of those people that have more, um, your your breasts are wide set or like, like east-west boobs, <laughs> they sit out, you know, that way, then this will work for you. And, you. and they're not, you know, extremely huge. But if you have north-south boobs, south, and then they, and you're trying to push them up, you're gonna have all this, <sighs> no, mm-mm. 
I hate that. I hate when you walk in and it's like, <laughs> I don't like that on me. No, thank you. Feels like it's right up under my chin, you know? Mm -mm. But if you, if you don't mind, whew, it's making me hot. I can't breathe. I'm just saying, baby, wee wee. <laughs> I just don't like, hey, you might like it, but I don't like the titty, tittying <laughs> and talking to me. No, no, not me. And yes, I'm eating my, um, my Wendy salad. Somebody call Wendy. And tell them that I ride hard <laughs> for their apple pecan. Follow. Oh.